Beyond budgeting is actually a somewhat misleading name, uh, and we know. The purpose of beyond budgeting is actually not necessarily to get rid of budgets. The purpose of beyond budgeting is to change traditional management into something radically different and better. Um, and if we want to change traditional management, um, we also need to do something with the budgeting process, which sits at the heart of traditional uh, management. So that's where the name is coming from. But every time I say beyond budgeting, please think about this as business agility, because that is basically what it is. Um, it was developed from day one back in the late 90s, uh, before the Agile Manifesto actually was, uh, was uh, developed. Um, it was defined and designed as an agile way of running an organization which um, makes it a little bit different from Agile because originally Agile was not designed um, and meant to be a way to run uh, enterprises. And that is why scaling Agile is difficult and challenging for several reasons. One reason is that when you scale Agile, holes become visible. Things that Agile or what I call early Agile didn't have to think about for for natural reasons. And these are the holes that beyond budgeting are filling. So there is a beautiful fit between agile and beyond budgeting. And um, as I will talk about uh, in my session, um, I don't think there can be any true agile transformation without beyond budgeting. So again, it is about business agility. It is quite a comprehensive leadership and management model. Um, there are six principles on leadership, there are six on management processes, and a strong focus on coherence between the two, between leadership messages and management processes. So beyond budgeting, business agility in practice.